Now, that technique used to construct the bridge is a newer way of doing things designed to create less disruption to the public. Our Team 10 investigator Adam Rakuzin is looking into the safety aspects of the accelerated bridge construction and why we could see it here as well. Adam. Yeah, think of it as prefab bridge making where parts can the bridge can be made in advance off site. When you build it that way, like in this case, you really don't have to shut down streets for months at a time to build over them. According to the university's news section, the bridge was lifted from its temporary supports, rotated 90 degrees and then lowered into its permanent position. That method is known as accelerated bridge construction. The U.S. Department of Transportation's website says it's a technique that uses innovative planning, design, materials and construction methods in a safe and cost effective manner to reduce on site construction time that occurs when you're building new bridges or replacing old bridges. We spoke with the bridge engineer who explained you can build everything that goes into that bridge at the location and then move those final pieces right into place. Uh, in accelerated construction, you mimic that final position with supports in the same, uh, at the same location. So the bridge doesn't know any different. It's basically supported at the ends um, offsite, and then you keep those supports in place as you swing it uh, into its final position. And Chris Hall, who you heard from right there, says, while it's a pretty new method of construction, it is a tool that engineers are using, and you could see it more in California. According to the American Road and Transportation Builders Association, more than 6% of the bridges in the state are classified as structurally deficient. Some of those are over roadways. This tool could also allow that time to basically allow them to go over that so you won't have that traffic congestion when they're building those bridges. Adam Rakusen, Team 10. Adam, thank you.